Plus, and I'm here to show you how to submit a caterpillar or a grub for identification to your local National Plant Diagnostic Lab. So, of course, most insects preserve very well in alcohol, and uh, in the case of soft-bodied insects like caterpillars and grubs, there is one more step that will help the specimen to be in better shape when it gets to the lab, and that is uh, dipping it in hot water. What you want to do is uh, get some water to boiling and put it into a cup. Get yourself a container that will hold liquids without leaking. And drop your caterpillar in there for about a minute. And then transfer it to a vial. Add your alcohol and ordinary rubbing alcohol. It works great. your container tightly and as an extra measure to prevent spillage, place it into a plastic bag and seal it up good. And I like to uh, have the, the specimen wrapped up nicely as a cushion uh, while it's uh, being shipped. Place it into a small box and a small box is uh, much preferred over an envelope or even a padded envelope for making sure that your sample doesn't get crushed while it's being shipped. Then uh, fill out the submission form as completely as you can with all your contact information and any information that might help a diagnostician, such as uh, what kind of damage the, the insect was doing, uh, the host plant that it was feeding on, where exactly it was found, and so on. Place your submission form in the box along with your sample. Seal it up good. And 